Hello, everyone. I am Terranimator. I'm Max and DM. And I'm the Doctor of Umbology. We are your friendly neighborhood shut-ins, bringing you Doki Doki Literature Club after a few <clears throat> minor technical setbacks. So, while we're doing that... Oh, and Eric... Fuck this shit. We might just running? It's running. Well, this is gonna be interesting. Hey, I hear something. Oh, you do? Oh, oh, full screen. You go to the uh, to, to full, full screen it. Yeah, there we go. All right. But, oh, what the? Okay, so I, you see the game on your screen, but I don't see it on the capture thing. I just see this, the Steam client. This is going to be interesting. Let's try again. Is What's displaying the, graphics slowly. Perf performance warning? Yeah. Is computer is displaying graphics slowly? Yeah, I don't. Oh. I don't hear any noise. Well, I hear noise out of my headphones, but I only get the... Like the Steam, I still only see the Steam client page. That's so weird. What if we just, like, I don't know, point the camera at it? Nah, I, I'm not going back to camera in front of screen quality. You want to try and send to your Steam? Okay. Well, I feel embarrassed. Well, we'll not go into that. Let's just get this game going because I don't want to do this. If this looks like this is a, a bit weird, that's because I'm. This has been, unlike all the other videos that we've done that was caught off my, my capture card. Please. This game is not suitable for a choice to be disturbed. Oh, well. that's fine to me. <laughs> <laughs> yep, this is being recorded off my MacBook and not with a yes. Mac screen recorder. Uh, I think you have to. Uh, oh, oops. Oh, oops. What? oops. Like, By agreeing. You agree that you are yeah, at least 13. 13, <laughs> of course. <laughs> of you course. Yeah, you might have to well, click. Oh, I could get a yeah, actual get a mouse. I could, there we go. An actual mouse. Let's just get a mouse. All right. Oh, there's the music. This game's not suitable for those, for children to be easily disturbed. Well, here we go. Actually, wait, hold on a second. Let's try it. All right, let's see if we can get, yeah, this full screen. Okay, here we go. Let's see, let's see settings here. If it will allow you to do settings. Okay, there you go. Uh, this is full, okay, okay, full so screen. Okay, full screen. Text speed is okay. Uh, okay, here we go. Well, here we go. Alright. Right. Yeah. Please uh, enter your name. What should I call myself? Just call yourself what you are. <laughs> it's not gonna matter, and I really mean that in the loose sense. <sighs> Dick. <laughs> My name is Dick. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. I am a literal dick. I don't care. Oh. Boy. <laughs> Fuck you. Stop doing this to us. Just, just, yeah. just pick something, you fucking idiot. Should? Okay. It means seasons in Japanese. Okay, fine. Whatever. Pollution. Alright, here we go. I guess we can do some of the... Like, Hey! Well, ladies and gentlemen, other than that, I'm going to challenge myself. I'm going to be completely silent <laughs> through this and not make any sexual jokes. Too bad. Too late. All right, so. Hey! Oh, as this oh, is it? Oh, I see an annoying uh, girl running toward me from the distance, waving her arms in the air like she's totally oblivious to any attention she might draw to herself. Okay. Wait, oh, you're oh, oh, oh god. Ah, okay. Damn it. Yeah. That girl is. What did I press? I think you might. Pre I think you pressed auto. Oh, okay. Well. Turn off. Wait. You turn off auto. Okay, oh, good. Okay. Okay. You know the kind of um, friend you, you never see yourself making uh, making a name, no. but it's just kind of things work out because you've known each other for so long. So this is where me say Ori. We used to walk to school together on days like this, but starting around high school, she would oversleep more and more frequently, and I would get tired of waking up. But if she's going to chase after me like this, I almost feel better off running away. However, I just sigh and idle in front of the crosswalk and let Sayori catch up to me. Eh, eh! <laughs> I overslept again! Alright, I guess I'll take over as Shun. He's my character. Fine. But I caught you this time. Maybe. 
But no. only because I decided. That's shutting you. <laughs> Can you not wait? Maybe. But only because I decided to stop and wait for you. Eh. You say that you. Um, you say that you like you were thinking about ignoring me? That's mean, Shun. Well, if, well, if people stare at you for acting weird, then I don't want them to think we're a couple or something. <laughs> fine, fine. But you did wait for me, after all. I guess you don't have to have it in you to be mean if I even want to. If you want to. Whatever you say, Sayori. <laughs> we cross the street together and make our way to school. As we draw near, the streets become increasingly speckled with other students making their daily commute. So I don't know why this game is so scary, you guys. It looks so normal. By the way, Shin, have you decided on a club to join yet? A club? I told you already, I'm really not interested. Yeah, it was apparently you. I told you already. I'm really not interested in joining any clubs. My life, exactly. <laughs> I didn't care. I haven't been looking either. And that's not true. You told me you would join a club this year. Did I? I'm sure, I'm sure it's possible that I did. In one of our many conversations where I dismissively go along with whatever she's going on about. Okay. Sayori likes to worry a little too much about me. When I'm perfectly content with just getting by on the average while spending my free time on games and anime. Okay. Guess who that reminds me of? Uh-huh. I was talking about how I'm worried that you won't learn how to socialize or have any skills before college. <laughs> <laughs> Ow. Ouch. <laughs> oh, wow. Ow, that hits right at home. Oh, God. Too close to home? Yeah. Jeez. Yeah. Okay. Your happiness is really important to me, you know. And I know you're happy now, but I die at the thought of you becoming a neat in a few years but because you're not used to the real world. What's a neat? Slang for unemployed young adult who okay. lives off their parents. Okay. All right. And spend time with anime and video games. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. All right. You trust me, right? Don't make me... Don't make me keep worrying about you. All right. All right. I'll look at a few clubs if it makes you happy. No promises, though. Will you at least promise me you'll try a little? Yeah, I'll promise you that, I guess. Yay! Why do <laughs> I let myself get lectured by such a carefree girl? Because I have a rock hard penis. More than that, <laughs> I'm surprised I even let myself relent to her. <laughs> I regret nothing. I regret nothing. Right. Right. Keep talking. You're going to regret something. Oh. Anyway. I guess seeing her worry so much about me makes me want to ease her mind at least a little bit. Even if she does exaggerate everything inside of her head. Okay. Cutscene. The school day is as ordinary as ever, and it's over before I know it. Yeah, that's not how, not how I remember school being at all. No. Right? No. No. Quite the opposite, actually. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. After I pack up my things, I stare blankly at the wall, looking for an ounce of motivation. That's what I do. Clubs. Aces. Diamonds. Spades. spades jokers. Cards. Instructions. Okay. Sayori wants me to check out some clubs. I guess I have no choice but to start <laughs> anime club. Oh, of course. Of course. <laughs> of course. Hey, oh. Sayori? Sorry about that. Yeah. Sayori must have come into the classroom while I was spacing out. Probably. I look around and realize I'm the only one left in the classroom. Yep. <laughs> I thought I'd catch you coming out of the classroom, but I saw you just sitting here and spacing out, so I came in. Honestly, you're even worse than me sometimes. I'm impressed. <laughs> wow, wait. thank you. <laughs> oh, wait. You don't need to wait up for me if it's going to make you late for your own club. Well, I thought you might need some encouragement, so I thought, you know. No 
What? Where is this going? Well, then you can come to my club. Sayori. Yay? Yeah? There is no way I'm going to your club. Oh. Eh, meanie. <laughs> Sayori is vice president of the literature club. Ah. Not that I was ever aware that she had any interest in literature. <laughs> Yeah, can't you tell? In fact, I'm 99% sure she only did it because she thought it would be fun to help start a new club. Yeah, that probably makes sense. Since she was the first one to show interest after the one who promised the club, she inherited the title Vice President. <laughs> wow, that's sketchy. That said, my interest in literature is guaranteed to be even less. Yeah, I'm going to the anime club. Come on, please. Why do you care so much anyway? Well, I kind of told the club yesterday I would bring in a new member. And Natsuki made cupcakes and everything. <laughs> Don't make promises you can't keep. Of course you would do this. <laughs> I can't tell if Sayori's... Is really that much of an airhead or she's so cunning as I've planned all this out. Yeah. I let out a long sigh. Fine. I'll stop by for a cupcake. Is this okay. gonna be like Happy Death Day where you eat the cupcake and you're gonna die? Will it? That's what happens in Happy Death Day. It, I'll talk about it later. It's just stupid. Yes! Let's go! Wow, my voice cracked for a second. And thus, today marks the day I <laughs> <our cupcake. laughs> I want that engraved on my tombstone. <laughs> I sold my soul for a cupcake. Eh, uh, I sold mine for less. Yeah, anyway. I dejectedly follow Sayori across the schools and upstairs, a section of the school I rarely visit, being generally used for third-year classes and activities. Sayori, full of energy, swings open the classroom door, Everyone, the new member is here! I told you, don't call me... Oh, sorry. I told you, don't call me a new member. Eh? I glance around the room. I guess you. <laughs> Welcome to the Literature Club. It's a pleasure meeting you. See, you always said, has nice things about you. Seriously? You brought a boy? You brought a boy? Way to kill the atmosphere. Uh, 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 sure. uh, a, a nice surprise. Welcome to the club. Uh, <laughs> uh, uh, <laughs> All words escape me in this situation. I mean, I would too if I saw this. This club. It's full of incredibly <laughs> <cute> <laughs> Oh, that's gonna be... What are you looking at? If you want to say something, say it. I'm not into lollies. <laughs> Sorry. Natsuki? Hmm. The girl with the sour attitude, whose name is apparently Natsuki, is one I don't recognize. Her small figure makes me think she's probably a first year. Wow, okay. She's also the one who made the cupcakes, according to Sayori. Hey, you can, you can just oh, ignore no, her. No, no, that, that's me. You can just ignore her when she gets moody. Mm -hmm. Sayori says that quietly in my ear, then turns back towards the other girls. Wait, if she said that in my ear, why is she standing in front of me? Yeah! <laughs> because... Because visual novels. Visual novels. <laughs> this is more. Anyway, this is Natsuki, always full of energy. And this is Yuri, the smartest one in the class. Club. D don't say things like that. Yuri, who appears comparably more mature and timid, seems to have a hard time keeping up with the people like Sayori and Natsuki. I like the music. Yuri's also slang for something else. Three guesses what? <laughs> yeah, I know. Uh, well, it's, uh, <laughs> nice 
to meet both of you. <sighs> I feel a cold sweat down the back of my spine. And it sounds like you already know Monica, is that right? That's right. Monica. Or Monique. Uh, it's American! You look at it, this is Monica. Uh, it's nice to see you again, Sean. Monica, Nika <laughs> smiles sweetly. <laughs> we do know each other. Well, we rarely ever talked, but we were in the same class last year. Good. Monika was probably the most popular girl in class. Smart, beautiful, athletic. <laughs> okay! <laughs> okay, just back away from me, dude. I knew I should have packed my taser. Basically, <laughs> completely. completely Completely out of my league. <laughs> I'm sorry. Okay. So, having her smile at me so genuinely feels a little, uh... You too, Monica. Come sit down, Shen. We made room for you at the table so you can uh, sit next to me or Monica. Oh, don't make a sadistic choice like this so far in game. <laughs> It's like, like I say, so far in the main, so close in. Yeah. I'll get the cupcakes. Hey, I made them. I'll get them. Sorry, I got a little too excited. Then how about uh, I make some tea as well? The girls have a few desks arranged to form a table. Um, as I already mentioned, it's been widened so that there is one space next to Monika and one space next to Sayori. Natsuki and Yuri are walk over to the corner of the room <laughs> when Atsuki grabs a wrapped tray and Yuri opens the closet. Wait. What's the Sitting, still feeling awkward, I take a seat next to Sayori. Okay, so I choose it for you. Atsuki proudly marches back to the table, tray in hand. Okay, are you ready? Ta-da! <laughs> Suki lifts the foil off the tray to reveal a dozen white, fluffy what? cupcakes decorated to look like little cats. Um, are, you, are you salivating? <laughs> you like pussy, don't you? <laughs> no, I like cupcakes. Okay. So what if I like dessert? <laughs> we already, you guys just had brownies earlier. It, it's not like I care anything. Baka. <laughs> Baka. The whiskers are drawn with icing. And little pieces of chocolate were used to make ears. <laughs> I swear it's not shit. Oh, <laughs> I swear it's not shit. It's so cute. cute. I just want to eat it up. No, so, literally, I'm stopping. Yeah, so cute. I, I had no idea you were so good at baking, Natsuki. Hey, <laughs> well, you know. Just, just hurry and take one. Sayori grabs one first, then Monika. I follow. It's delicious. Sayori so talks with her mouthful and has already managed to get icing on her face. I turn the cupcake around in my fingers, looking for the best angle to take a bite. Uh, Natsuki is quiet. Wait, wait, what? I can't help but notice her sneaking glances um, in my direction. Uh, what's going on? Now then. What kind of dairy are you? <laughs> oh, yeah. oh no. Is she waiting for me to take a bite? I finally bite down. The icing is sweet and full of flavor. I wonder if she made it herself. I think I know what she probably used to... Use it. Oh, sure. <laughs> just, let's just read the lines. This is really good. I'm tasting. Thank you, Natsuki. Why are you why are you thanking me? It, it, it's not like I Yep! <laughs> Soon the ray! <laughs> Haven't I heard this somewhere before? May them for you or anything. Baka. <laughs> eh? I thought you technically did. Sayori said. Well, maybe. But not for, you know, you, dummy. All right. 
All right. I give up on that two-piece <laughs> weird logic and dismiss the conversation. Oh, God. Yuri returns to the table, carrying a tea set. She carefully places a teacup in front of each of us before setting down the teapot next to the cupcake tray. Hey, you keep a whole tea... Oh, no. You keep a whole tea set in the classroom? Wait. Hey, wait. Don't... Don't worry, the teacher get gave us permission. After all, that, doesn't a hot cup of tea help you enjoy a good book? Uh, I guess. Uh... <laughs> Don't let yourself get intimidated. Gary's just trying to impress you. Um, yeah, you're really caught in that harem. Damn it, Dan. Look at their faces. Look at their faces. <laughs> <laughs> Who has the bigger boobs? Honestly, you're right. <laughs> that's that's not, that's, that's not insulted. Yuri looks away. I mean, uh, you know, I believe I, you. Uh, I uh, believe fuck. you. I don't know we what the just... character is talking. Okay. Well, tea and reading might not be a pastime for me, but at least I enjoy tea. I sure as hell don't. I never like tea. Now, if it was oh, lemonade and horse semen, that would be... What the fuck? It's a, it's a, it's a it's jackass a joke. joke. No, it's not a jackass joke. It was a touch oh, oh. Okay. I'm going to pretend I didn't hear that. Okay. So, oh, oh, God. Which one was this? You, you were just a normal. So, I'm, I'm glad. Yuri faintly smiles at herself in relief. Okay. Monica raises an eyebrow, then smiles at me. So, what made you consider the literature club? Um... <laughs> yeah! <laughs> I was afraid of this question. Yeah. Something tells me I shouldn't tell Monika that I was practically dragged here by yeah. some Yeah, yeah, really. Well, I haven't joined any clubs yet, and Sayori seems really happy here, so... That's okay. Don't be embarrassed. We'll make sure you feel right at home, okay? As president of the Literature Club, it's my duty to make the club have fun and exciting for everyone. Monica, I'm surprised. How come you decide to start your own club? You'll probably be a board member for any of the major clubs. Weren't you a leader of the debate club last year? <laughs> well, you I know. hate that pose. I really hate that pose. <laughs> well, you know. To be honest, I can't stand and all the politics around the major club. And then she like sticks her ass up in front of you while she's doing that. <laughs> not making a joke. Not making a joke. But I can. <laughs> it feels like nothing but arguing about the budget and publicity and how to, how to prepare for events. Wow, the Japanese are very. I'd much rather take something I personally enjoy and make something special out of it. And if it encourages others to get into literature, then I'm fulfilling that dream. Well, let's try. Monika really is a great leader. Yuri also nods in agreement. Then I'm surprised there aren't more people in this club yet. Must be hard to start a new club. You could put it that way. Not many people are very interested in putting... Uh, not all the effort to start something brand new. Like sex. Especially when it's something and it doesn't grab your attention, like literature. Mm. You have to work hard, hard to convince people that you're both fun and worthwhile. Don't look at me like that. Don't look at me like that. But, it's, but it makes school events, like the festivals, that much more important. No. 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 I'm confident that we can all really grow. No! God damn it! God damn it! You're really trying to <laughs> really Stop it. grow this club before we graduate. Mm. Right, everyone? Yeah. We do our best. You know it. Everyone enthusiastically agrees. <laughs> Such different girls, all interested in the same goal. Yep. Monica must have really worked hard just to find these three. 
Yeah, I'm sure she did. Maybe that's why they're all so delighted by the idea of a new member joining. Oh! Although I still don't really know if I can keep up with their level of enthusiasm. I'm about your pillow chair. right now! Like, so, sh and what kind of things do you, you would like to read? Well, uh... Well, then... Damn it! <laughs> manga. Uh, you manga! Manga! <laughs> yeah, manga. Pussy! <laughs> you pussy! I'm gonna quietly to myself. Half joking. Yeah, half joking. Matsuki's head suddenly perks up. It looks like she wants to say something, but she keeps quiet. <laughs> Why are you looking at me? Because I perked up. Please don't ever talk about fucking up. Okay. Uh, not much of a veto, I guess. Well, that can change. Damn it. Oh. What are you saying? I spoke without thinking mm -hmm. after seeing Yuri's sad smile. I, I think that may have just been it. Just, you know. Anyway, what about you, Yuri? Well, let's see. Yuri traces the rim of her teacup with a finger. My favorites are usually novels that build deep and complex fantasy worlds. So that's essentially manga. <laughs> it can be. Yeah. yeah. The level of creativity and craftsmanship between them is amazing to me. Okay. And telling a good story in such a, a foreign world is equally impressive. Okay. Y Yuri goes on, clearly passionate about her reading. She seemed so reserved and timid since the moment I walked in, but it's obvious by the way her eyes light up that she finds her comfort in the world of books, not people. Yep. But, you know, I like lots of things. Stories with deep psychological elements usually immerse me as well. Isn't it amazing how a writer can so deliberately take advantage of of your own lack of imagination to completely throw you for a loop. You just put a giant flashing foreshadowing? Yeah. yeah. Anyway, I've been reading a lot of horror lately. Oh, you're one of those crazy bitches. I read a good horror. I read a good horror okay. book. Ah! I read a good horror book once. I did too. It was called The Creepy Pasta. I desperately grasp something I can relate to at the minimal level. At this rate, Yuri might as well have a conversation with a rock. <laughs> if it's a man! <laughs> what the rock? He's cooking. Well, I mean, he said. Allah rock. Akbar! Uh, not that rock. <laughs> That's. I, I, really? really? I, I wouldn't have expected that, Yuri. There's someone as gentle as you. I guess you could say that. But if it's if a story thinks me think or take me to another world, then I can't really can't put it down. So real horror is often very successful at changing the way you look at, at the world, if only for a brief moment. Yeah, I mean... Ugh, I hate horror. Oh, why is that? Well, I just... Matsuki's eyes start over to me for a split second. <laughs> You're like, why is it over? Never mind. I, I, that's right. I usually like to write about cute things, don't you, Natsuki? Ooh, shots fired! <laughs> what? What gives you that idea? You'll have some piece of scrap paper behind <laughs> <that>. <laughs> 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 It looked, like, it looked like you were working on a poem called... Don't say it out loud! And give that back! Fine, fine. <laughs> your cupcakes, your poems. Everything you do is just as cute as you are. So you oh, like okay, then. behind Natsuki and puts her hands on her shoulders. Oh, uh, that's creepy. <laughs> it could be worse. Yeah. I'M NOT CUTE! <laughs> Natsuki, you wrote your own- you write your own poems? Eh, well, I guess sometimes. 
Why do you care? I think that's impressive. Why don't you share them sometime? No! That's who gave her a what, 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 What's on the... Should I say? Should I ask? You, you wouldn't like them. Eh? Huh? Not a very confident writer yet? She writes Shurikan. Damn it. <laughs> okay, so before we start recording this, I, I told Max and Dan about Boko no Pico. And, uh, and, and I told them, don't look it up. But they looked it up. And they never, they haven't watched it, but they know the gist of it. And they, <sighs> I, anyway, I understand how Natsuki feels. Sharing that level of writing takes more, more than just confidence. The truest form of writing is writing to oneself. You must be willing to open to, up to your readers, exposing your vulnerabilities and showing even the deepest reaches of your heart. Do you have an experience too, Yuri? Maybe if you share some of your work, we can get an example and help Natsuki feel comfortable enough to share hers. Lipsies. I guess it's the same for Yuri. No, damn it, shit. Oh. <sighs> I guess it's the same for Yuri. I'll stop you maybe before he gets there. Oh, I wanted to read everyone's poems. We all sit in silence for a moment. Okay. I have an idea, everyone. Huh? Mm -hmm. Natsuki and Yuri look quizzically at Monika. What does she want? Oh, oh shit. Oh, what'd you do? Wait, uh, can, wait, can, can you go? Can you go back? Ah, oh, you can't. I'm a bit mouse happy, alright? Uh, you can't. Wait, what's history? Well, oh, okay. So we, we'll just find out what she just said. Okay, I have, yeah, I have, I have an idea, everyone. Uh, let's all go home and write a poem of our own. Okay. Sorry, I... Oh god, I just missed a critical plot point. Return. Double click. Okay. Ne <laughs> then next time, I will I will meet, we'll share them with each other. Okay. That way, everyone's even. Okay. Um... Ellipses. Yay! Let's do it! Plus, now that we have a new member, I think we, it can help it, us, all no. get more, yeah, no. us all get more comfortable with each other and strengthen the bond of this That's club. That's not the only bond I'll have here. Isn't that right, Shion? Uh, Monica smiles at me once again. More like, hold on, there's still one problem. Huh? What's that? I'm 13! Now that we're back in... <laughs> One moment, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> I still regret nothing! Now that we're back to the original topic of me joining the club, I bluntly come forth with what's been on my mind the entire time. I never said I would join this club! Oh, no, you done fucked up. <laughs> you done <laughs> fucked up. Sayori may have convinced me to stop by, but I never made any decision. I still have other clubs to look at, and... Um... I lose my train of thought. Yep, oh. you fucked up. You oh, done course. fucked up! <laughs> Girls stare back at me with the same dejected eyes. <laughs> but... I'm sorry, I thought... <laughs> You, you all. Uh, I'm defensive against these girls. Defenseless! How am I supposed to make a clear headed decision when it's like this? That is, if writing poems is the price I need to pay in order to spend every day with these beautiful girls. Yeah. Right. Okay, I've decided then. I'll join the literature club. One by one, <laughs> the girl's eyes lighten up. <laughs> yes, I'm so happy! 
Zarya wraps her arms around me, jumping up and down. Meanwhile, he wants uh, Shin wants to kill himself. <laughs> hey! Do you? You really did scare me for a moment. If you really just came here for the cupcakes, I would be super pissed. <laughs> and that makes it official. Welcome to the Literature Club. Uh, thanks. I guess. Okay, everyone. I think that uh, we can officially end today's meeting on a good note. Everyone remember tomorrow's assignment. Tonight's. Tonight's assignment. <laughs> Write a poem to bring to the next meeting so we can all share. Uh, Monika looks over me once more. Shun, I hope. I hope. I look forward to seeing how you express yourself. Uh. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> can I really impress the class star Monika with my mediocre writing skills? Hey, they might be better than our writing. <laughs> oh no. Shun, old buddy, you are in very good hands. You're good writing? Well, I mean, not, we're not good writing. I am. Okay. Not to toot my own horn. Can toot I really toot. impress this class star, yeah. Monika, with my mediocre writing skills? I already feel the anxiety welling up inside me. I'm already having the anxiety of just playing this Meanwhile, game. the girls continue to chit-chat as Yuri and Natsuki clean up their food. Hey, Shin, since we're already here, do you want to walk home together? That's right. Sorry, and I... Never walk home together anymore because she always stayed after school for clubs. Sure, might as well. Yay!